It's a dragon. <laughs> oh no, the dragons are coming. <laughs> Good job, Toothless. <laughs> Hi friends, my name is Kieran. Welcome to the room. Um, today, Toothless is going to hang out and watch the dragons with me because we're watching season two, episode two of Vox Machina, which is called The Trials of Vasselheim. Episode one, they said four dragons attacked the city, which I thought was called Tal'Darae. Tal'Darae? Tal'Darae. But I guess Tal'Darae is the, the whole place, and the city's called Aeon? -A -A Aeon? -E -E I don't remember. I'll, I'll look. There's one I'm clearly missing. There's the fire dragon whose name is Thordak, who is not voiced by Keith David like I originally thought it was. Um, then there's um, an ice dragon. Then there's poison gas dragon. And electricity dragon was named Brimscythe, and that dragon is dead. That's the dragon they killed at the beginning of season one. So I'm only counting three dragons. Um, another thing is I was really, I think I mentioned this in the last videos, I was really thrown off by the dragons being able to talk. I don't know, that just, I don't know, I really don't really like that. I just feel, it adds a different element to the dynamic of the relationship between dragons and humans. The fact that the dragons are able to communicate, it, also I'm, because they said that it's very unusual for different species of dragons to work together with each other, I'm under the impression that these dragons are being controlled by something, someone. And then um, the only other thing that I, did I write that down? Yes. The other thing that I wrote down that I really wanted to um, address is uh, Scanlan's acting weird. Like, like weird for Scanlan, right? So maybe that's nothing and I'm reading into something that's not there, but that's how it felt to me. If you want to see these episodes early, you can do so over on my Patreon where I have all the things early and fully uncut. Um, if you want to follow me on my other social media, links to that are in the description down below. Now, that brings us to the main event. One, two, three. Okay. It worked! <laughs> I can't believe it actually worked! Oh, they forgot that. Oh no, where did they go? Oh crap. Oh, shit. Guys, stop! No, no, no! Don't step in! Ah! <laughs> oh god. These titties were here. <laughs> what? Okay, that was not my fault. I told Keeper Yenin I have to know. Keeper Yenin, not Leader so Yenin. Okay. Vague. Whoa. You guys, we made it. Oh. Is that Vassum? Uh, Vagil? Vasselheim. Remember, we're not here as tourists. We need to find allies to fight the Conclave. I have a good feeling about this place, Percy. Don't worry. Oi, state your business. Stop the marshals, go to the Platinum Sanctuary and find him yourself. Now, good day. Um, did he say good day? Oh, and the bear waits. Waits outside, yes, we know. Aww. Trinket never gets to go. It usually works. Of course, darling. I'm sure it happens to all the nobles. Good day. Oh, good day. Oh, good day. Oh, good day. Taurus. Good day. Lots of temples and no brothels. You're telling me people choose to live here? Almost every prime deity is represented. And I got this. Pardon us, we come seeking an audience. You have our sympathies and our hospitality. But that is all. You won't help us? You have weapons, ballista, armies. You have the strongest city in the world. Uh, diplomacy demands Let me correct you. Vasselheim's most potent weapon is not its artillery, young man. But until then, this peril is yours alone. Now, good day. I really don't blame them. I really, I really don't blame them. Good day. Oh, gods. 
we're getting better. Ah, oh, the creepy lady. They saw the Who the fuck are you? And they didn't even care. I mean, they have a duty to justice. Okay. No. Spying on us. Yes, I mean, no. Uh, I mean, I heard what you said in there. The Slayer's take? <sighs> Don't ask. A group of hunters for hire. Vasselheim used to be surrounded by legendary beasts until the take cleared them out. Legendary beasts? Like dragons? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What? No. You're not yours, buddy. Yeah, we might have to watch out for that sword. That might be a problem. Well, they spelled some of it right. Remember, no one in the Slayer's take is to be trusted. Who? Me? But you! Ah, you have those faces. They're... they're just so familiar. Where have I seen them before? Oh. <laughs> oh, that's right. You're famous. Why are they wanted? Eyes up, gang! We got ourselves a bounty. <laughs> well, point to representation. Time to find my friends and save the world! Ooh! <laughs> Me. Whoa. <laughs> oh, nice decor too. Control your ADHD, Grog. Go find your friends. The Storm Lord is not concerned with dragons. His interest is in warriors, but you are no warrior. Your mind is clouded with weakness. Weak? <laughs> you got the wrong guy. The answers you seek are earned, not given. I'm Vex, Zara's very close friend. Cash are. But you can call me Cash. Like money. So clever. You are very close to me. Hey, Z, are you expecting annoying visitors? Huh. You're not as charming as you think, Vexalia. You never were. Hmm. As much as I'd love to chit-chat, we're actually on urgent business. We need to see your patron. No one sees her. <laughs> Please. They're destroying Taldore, killing Her tail is people. very lizard-like, but then she has ram money. horns, so... Saving lives. I don't know what species she is. <laughs> I just want to put her in my pocket. <laughs> I know, she's so cute. Look, we're not here to fight you. Oh, this will be easy then. <laughs> Damn it! Don't you get it? We're trying to save the fucking world! Uh. <laughs> Where do you find your strength? What you mean? Between worlds, weakness in mind and weakness in conviction. Where does your strength come from? Yeah, I think he knows what he's doing. Yeah, I gotta say, I'm not a fan of the sudden drops today. I recall you saying you were friends with those people. I may have misjudged our relationship. Look, God, this city blows. usually, you know, come back. Weapons are useless here. You're scared. I wonder, how do you hope to avenge Amon when darkness makes you tremble? A sphinx. Ooh. Oh, I didn't realize they still existed. We humbly That's seek your cool. aid. That's cool. Yes. You hope to save Taldore. You know of the dragons? Please, we're desperate. But you haven't the slightest idea what it will cost. If, what's the word I'm trying to think of? If pop culture has taught us anything, it's that you can't trust a sphinx. 
depended entirely on your sister. He's having never-ending story you flashbacks. Hopelessly seeking your father's love. Both unprepared. Why would I listen to the cursed heir, who wallows in self-pity, begging to be trusted again? <laughs> Failing your alimente, or knowing no one will live long enough to see you achieve it. You don't have to call out my shit, okay? I know I can be kind of annoying. <laughs> Where does your strength come from? This is one of them trick questions. You want me to say my muscles or my rage, but I know it's my heart. That's my real strength. Wrong. Where does your strength come from? Hey, like, look, dude, I don't have time for these, these deep philosophical questions, okay? seen the same for a hundred years. Fools who think they can make a difference but can't deliver. Would you sacrifice your life just to prove a point? I don't care if I die. None of us do. But we're not leaving. Uh, speak for yourself. We won't be ignored. Seeking the path to true strength is the first step. <sighs> cool. <laughs> You'll, um, show me the next one? Of what? The vestiges of divergence. In the great Ooh. calamity, these weapons of war were created to strike down the gods themselves. And the other vestiges? Will be revealed in turn. Find this one and bring it to my mate. Nice. Big fan of mating over here. As the Knowing Mistress heals in exile to protect her sacred wisdom, we must remain apart. It pains me, yet it is for a greater good. Thank you. We won't let you down. It's not me you need to worry about letting down. Only each other. Our patron has a job for you. Guess I'm quite charming after all. I'd say it was nice catching up, but... It wasn't. <sighs> Vasselheim wasn't what we expected. We came to get an army, but maybe we got something better. Inspiration. Huh. That's a new one for us. Uh, what happened to you? Oh, an old man beat me up. <sighs> so, booze. Well, yeah! <laughs> First man. round's on you, big man. Really? Do you recall what this other customer looked like? Oh, sure! I remember her well, cause she had one hand! Kinda like me! <laughs> I've learned from my mistakes! Ripley. Oh, Ripley! Oh, so Ripley is still a concern. I forgot about her. Hey, don't blow yourself up! Bye! I, t I know that voice. Uh-oh. Oh, fuck. Okay. They... I didn't make any notes. Sorry, Toothless, there were no dragons in that episode. <laughs> Sphinx, whose name I don't remember, is sending them on a quest to find vestiges. I'm going to guess there's going to be seven vestiges, like a vestige per person. I'm not really sure what a vestige is. Um, so I'll, I'll look that, you know what? Let's just look it up now. Vestige. A trace of something that is disappearing or no longer exists. Oh, really? Well, if it's the trace of something that's disappearing or no longer exists, I uh, suppose it's going to be very difficult to find. Um, I feel like we can try trust the sphinx but i'm a little apprehensive 
I think that there's definitely something like the the vampire lord, the vampire lord sword that Grog has. That's definitely going to play in at some point. Um, I think maybe a lot of our characters um, facing difficult challenges um, that they've been putting off, things they don't want to deal with, um, things they've been ignoring. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because I appreciate it. That's the end, and I will see you later. Okay, bye.